Hello, party people. We're at the Dollar Tree today. Today, sure are. We're going to check out their Easter stuff. They should have it out. It's March. Am I right? Sometimes my Dollar Tree doesn't have all this stuff out right away, so that's why I like to wait a little later. Anyway, who cares? Let's go inside, check out all the cool things they have for this new season slash holiday. like they're fully stocked. I don't see a lot of boxes anywhere. Here is the wall of happiness and then an entire wall of fillable eggs. Oh my gosh, they even have baskets here. Look how fancy. They've got a carousel of floral, arts and craft moment over here. Even some candy. Yes, peeps are the worst part of Easter. Oh wait, they're jelly bean peeps. Those might be okay. Stuffed animals, we're gonna keep walking. Oh, St. Patty's Day socks, where are the Easter socks? This aisle full of, I don't know, a bunch of Easter fun, we're gonna explore. Oh, I forgot they sold potting soil just for a dollar. They also have pots because it is that season. Time to revamp your garden. They have all the supplies that you need. Maybe not all of them, <laughs> but they do have seeds. They even have vegetable seeds, and the best part about it is they cost $1 for four packets. The best price you're gonna find anywhere. Oh my word, they have a ton of cute stuff for the fairy garden, if you have one, or just garden accessories in general. Oh my goodness, that bee that says welcome, adorable. And they have a whole aisle of basket fillers over here. I even see some summer stuff building up, bubbles, sand buckets and goggles for a dollar. Okay, let's start over here, right in the corner. They have this little decor piece. It's like that tinsel material. I don't know, it's pretty cute. And then a felt bunny garland with little pom-pom bums. It's pretty adorable. Eight pieces in there. Eight bunny, oh, tinsel garland. Okay, this is new stuff. I haven't seen this before. Very cute. Some more garland right there. Bunnies, chicks, all the Easter decor. Every bunny welcome, hippity hoppity Easter. I like these two signs right here. They're glittery in person. Those might be my favorite. They're very adorable. All bunnies welcome again. Oh, these two are cute as well. I like it, I like it. All this stuff actually, those wooden signs too. Here's some more baskets down here with the bunny ears. Some more wooden signs. We believe in the Easter bunny. If you don't believe, he won't bring you a basket. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Some more big felt. I don't even know what those are. The decor, felt decor. Oh, these are some stakes that you can shove in your front yard. Tell the bunny to stop at your house. I like those as well, the little egg stakes at the bottom. I didn't notice those. I like that print in the back, the floral print. Cute. Oh, here's another yard stake down there, kind of grady. They also have these solar lights. There's some up here, solar lights as well. A dollar for those seems like a great deal. And then they have these daisies in a vase. Uh-oh, where does that belong to? <laughs> I'll just put that right there, call it a day. Daisies fall out easily, apparently. Ooh, more garland. I like that they're doing this. They've got some gel window clings. Oh, more up there, cute. Oh, and then these signs, you can paint them create them however you feel. Happy Easter, I like it. Oh, and these wooden signs down here. These boxed wooden signs are really sweet as well. Happy Easter, and then follow the bunny. He's got that chocolate. So do I, okay? But don't follow me, because it's all mine. Some bunny faces. All right, ooh, I missed that sign. The hunt is on. This one's cute too. I don't think I missed it. I just didn't really take a good look at it. Let's take a look behind me over here. Oh, I like these little table covers. And then they have these ice cube trays. What else can you make with these? They're like the silicone molds, you know? Jello, <laughs> chocolate, I guess. They have one with the bunny. 
And then, oh, treat bags. Great, great, if you're handing out treats. Oh, this little egg platter, that's like a Kim size serving of deviled eggs. Do you know what I mean? Like I need one four times that big if I'm gonna bring it to a gathering. They've got napkins and plates. Always a great deal on these plates. I think it's an eight count. Let's double check. Stop it right now, it's an 18 count. Now that is a screaming deal for just a dollar. They usually have cups too, but I don't see any cups. Oh, okay, we saw these last year. Like a 3D bunny, you can connect it together, but you can put a big gift in there. I think someone mentioned, maybe Nicole Burr just mentioned, like putting a bathing suit in there for the summertime. I think that's a great idea. Or even like an Easter outfit, that's a cute idea too. Those novelty glasses, always a hit. Okay, peeps on a headband, I'm here for it. I really like this one too. Kind of looks like a cat. You can pull it off as a cat. Oh my gosh, there's four in there. <sighs> Time for a party. Let's, let's plan a party, okay? Everyone can wear those bunny ears. And then these. The glittery ones, only one for a dollar, but totally worth it. All right, coloring eggs. Do you guys do egg coloring? This is a deal, the dollar. Because that Target, that's like $2.50. Not even joking. Then they have all these boxes of kits. They even have a sign right here. It says, we sell eggs because this Dollar Tree has a refrigerated section. It's crazy. And then, do you see all those baskets? Hold on, turn this one around. All those baskets, they're kind of flimsy. They're not gonna last you a lifetime, but like they're a dollar, do you know what I mean? They also have a lot more baskets up top here. Look at this one. It has a bunny like etched into it, multiple colors for you. One that says princess, happy Easter. I like those and they have like some wicker baskets. All right, what's over here? Hopping toy. Oh gosh, that seems fun. A glitter putty. All my kids would like that, but I would not. Okay, glitter gets all over, not glitter, putty, goop, whatever that's called. Slime is foreboding in my house. Uh, oh, a paddle ball, that's great. You wanna hit yourself in the face. Modeling foam. Okay, this stuff is not so bad, I approve. What's this, a flying disc. Okay, seems fun. Some bubbles, always a hit. What are these? Oh, sticker scenes. This seems fun. All right, I'm here for it. Would be cooler if it was magnetic and like reusable, you know? Notepads right there, that's pretty sweet. Some stamps, cool classic crayons, and some erasers. Those are cute erasers. I feel like the ears would fall off of that. Also balloons, and then, oh, some more like the 3D eggs that you can shove. Golden egg, do you guys do golden egg for Easter? Whoever gets it is like, that's like our money egg, you know? Do you guys even do a money egg? If so, how much money do you fit in your egg? Do you fit in your egg? How much money do you put in the egg? Are we talking like a dollar or a hundred, twenty dollars? Do you fill up enough? money eggs so each kid gets one and then oh my gosh god forbid one kid finds two money eggs it's like the best day of their life <laughs> so some of these i'm thinking different quality because you get 18 eggs in there for a dollar these faces you get 10 10 eggs 10 eggs this one you only get six but they're jumbo these are like tribal print down there um some of them are glittery i found some glittery ones looks like that is a hit not many of those left. Oh look, six little golden eggs. Easy to hide. What's your favorite hiding spot for an egg? Oh wait, they have some grass down there. I thought it was edible, but I think, I do not believe it is. Oh, they even have eggs in the shape of bunnies. So is it really an egg? I don't know. I remember the first money egg I found was in like the tailpipe of my parents' car. Okay, they're getting fancy with the eggs in this section. Dinosaur egg, wait, is that a dinosaur? I can't imagine what else it would be. Some kind of animal egg, <laughs> animal egg. And they have like some tie-dye ones, more glittery ones. They have, oh, what is that called? A carrot. Oh, these are already stuffed, pre-stuffed. Mr. Eggs, that's pretty fancy. These shell ones, the cross. I like it all. I'm here for it. Oh, is that a pig? That can't be a pig. What is that? Oh, a pink bunny. Okay, that makes sense. And then some animal eggs down there. All right. 
Also, let me know your favorite thing to fill the eggs with. What are these, foam eggs? Oh, you can make your own little garland. A little craft bottle right there. Obviously in the crafting section. Ooh, everyone's so happy. A coloring paint set deal. What do you get, nine pieces? Is that including each piece of paint? And then you only get two pieces, okay. And a paintbrush, well, man, better than nothing, you know? They sell just the paint here for a dollar, so I would call that a deal. You get some crafting yarn, Oh No, it's just a kit, you can make a little pom-pom bunny. Great to keep the kids busy for like five seconds. A little chick back there, ceramic paint set. They've got eggs and, oh, that's all I see. Oh wait, a little chick and an egg. Okay, popping out. Looks like they have some mesh and ribbon, very pastel. They have the sweetest little spring area over here. If you're planning a little springtime tea party, any kind of party, napkins, plates, little bowls right there, ice cream sundaes. They have napkins, more party plates in the shape of a flower, hi. They always have, oh my gosh, this is always a deal, the cutlery for just a dollar. They've got some headbands tablecloths. These are wooden and they say hello spring and the pink one says welcome little. Oh wait, there's a white one too. Nice variety. Spring is in the air. They even have some garland, hanging decor and cute little butterfly headbands. They also have some flower lays to get your party started and some treat bags right there to finish your party off. How many do you get? 10 treat bags. Okay, here are some more uh, crafts over here. A lot more, actually. Let's dive in. They have two little wreath holders. Always a great deal for that, a dollar. They have these stickers. I don't think they belong here. Someone changed their mind. They would rather have bunnies. Um, this is always fun, too. A little canvas with paint. Some felt shapes. Oh my gosh, an egg decorating kit and it's pirates. That is sweet. What else do they have? Superhero egg decorating kit. Okay, I'm looking at the garden section and they have little string lights. Do you see the different ones? We're just gonna push the button and light them up because I am a child. Yes, what are these, butterflies? Oh, dragonflies, I'm not even showing you. Look how stinking adorable those are just for a dollar. So they have butterflies and leaves and flowers and stuff. They also have little gnomies and little houses. I've always wanted a fairy garden, but I just know, oh my gosh, it's a cactus. That is darling. And a pine cone. Why do I love all of this stuff? It's just because it's miniature. Why do we love everything that is small? Like babies, you know what I mean? Oh, this little camper. Oh my goodness gracious. I've always wanted a fairy garden. Stop it. Right this instant. They made their own little seesaw out of wood. They're so creative. Those porcupines did too, or hedgehogs, whatever they are. I don't even care. They're just so darling. I've never made a fairy garden because at Michael's, all the fairy garden stuff is like $100 for one little piece. It's totally doable here at the D2 because everything is a dollar. Okay, I'll go through this a little slowly. This time they have wind chimes right there, some butterflies and bugs, all the fun stuff that come out during spring. I just bought some pruners, pruners, whatever those are called, from Target for $5 and they have them here at the Dollar Tree, someone told me. They also have gardening gloves. Let me take a feel. Let me check on the qual. Oh, they're plastic. Okay, just so you know, if you want some plastic ones, they have you. These don't look like they're plastic though. Okay, these aren't, but they're still like, you know, dollar quality. If you're not gonna garden a ton, those are perfect. Hose attachments. What else do they have? Temperature gauges. Oh, these little, stop it, a flag stand? Guys, at Lowe's that thing is like $29.99. <laughs> not really, but probably close to 10 bucks. Here's, oh wait, was that for like growing tomatoes or something? I'm such a gardener, I know nothing. What is this, a flower pot hugger? Oh my gosh, they even have flower pot accessories. A ladybug, what's back there, a gnome? Oh my gosh, it's a gnome. And I think there might be a frog back there. Can we get to it? Oh, a turtle, so darling. I just woke Meredith up getting so excited about that gnomey. They even have shovels, 
and um, plant labels. What else have we got here? I don't know what those are, but if you need them, <laughs> and if you know what they are, they have them. House plants? What is this, a fertilizer spray? I didn't even know those existed. Am I supposed to put them in my plants? Maybe that's why all my plants are dying. Good reason, they've got some garden stones and flexible tie. Okay, okay. Down here, some more things. Oh, they even have little grow kits down there. You see them? Oh, it's blurry, why is it blurry? There, there they are. Grow some strawberries, some flowers, daisies. Oh, and they have weed barriers. Four by eight for that weed barrier. They have soil, watering cans. Ooh, save your knees. Little baby lanterns. Look at those lanterns. Hummingbird nectar for a dollar. Um, and then they have a bunch of pots for said plants. Oh my gosh, and they're pretty good size for just a buck. They have bags for your baskets to keep all the innards inside. Oh my gosh, and then we have entered. They sell blasters for a dollar. Oh my gosh, stop it. They have these little, um, what are these called in real life? Lego Roblox people, unbelievable. They have a pretty good assortment. Legos right there and Oh, these are cute, these little tins. Wait, these are bath toys is what they're trying to sell in here. But they have a ton of tins. This is very cool. This one has dinosaurs. Very cool. Well, if that didn't wake Meredith up, I don't know what will. Uh-oh. All right, she slept through it. She's used to my loud mouth. I have a Rubik's Cubes. Is that what that's called? A Rubik's Cube? Probably not. Here is some more basket stuffers, but what's inside? Oh my gosh, you get a tin and a puzzle. Let's see if we could see any other thing. Oh, the PJ mask. Wear the PJ mask. They have Toy Story 4, Frozen, The Lion King, Mickey, Minnie. All the people are ready to party. They have building sets over here. Guys, for a dollar? Are you kidding? Why shop anywhere else? I don't know. Target is pretty alluring though. Stop it right now personal size pack of golden Oreos. I'm gonna have to refrain. Someone made a choice. <laughs> Someone's kid was probably like, mom, I want these. And she's like, no, put it down. Okay, stuffed animals right there. Some more, what are these puzzles? Oh, jumbo playing cards. Okay, here for it. They've got Superman, princesses. They have Play-Doh, is this Play-Doh? Crayola dough, ooh, I like that. They have all different colors of the Crayola dough. Oh my goodness, guys, they even have these magnetic boards. Can I tell you, I know Toy Story is like in theme again because the fourth one just came out. Have you seen it, by the way? It's awesome. <laughs> Alex and I watched it without the kids so we wouldn't be interrupted. But we did a Toy Story birthday party many years ago and I was looking for these Etch-a-Sketches everywhere. They're expensive, so if you find them at the Dollar Tree, which I could not at the time, I think they're seasonal items, so pick them up. Some more basket stuffers. What are these, bracelets? Oh, that's a cute little basket stuffer. What more do they have? Flowers, butterflies, and stars. Okay, cool, moving on. What's in here? What is that, a pretzel? What on earth? Ooh, it's got mustard on it, done. I'll eat it, I'm just saying. Ponies, oh, silly putty, now that is okay. Usually doesn't get stuck. Oh my gosh, they even have the proper Etch-a-Sketch on brand right there. Etch-a-Sketch doodle, three and up, just for a buck. I don't know how they do it. Okay, darts, they've got darts. Barbie dolls, yes, those microphones. Um, A hit, it's an echo mic. So much fun, hours and hours. They've got a baby Jenga right there, some cars. Ooh, a spiral art. I feel like my kids would like that. Oh my gosh, even those slinkies. Is that a slinky? I'm pretty sure it is. A soldier with a tank. You guys, make it blocks. Very cool. What's this, a ball? Ooh, a glow ball. Card games right here. Oh my goodness, and then these, I wonder if they make noise. Oh, they sure do. They come with like a little battery clip right there. 
All right, police car, ambulance, all the cool toys. Oh, some more slime, it's glitter slime. Stay out of my way, yo-yos, and then Play-Doh for a dollar. Oh, those balls, I'm gonna grab one of these. We go to the park all the time, and Wentworth is, yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work. We'll get this one, it's a good one. Okay, glow sticks. And, ooh, water squirters, always a fun time. Beach toys already, up. Oh, what are you selling for the beach? Oh, little floaties, okay, and then they have egg chalk, always a hit for a dollar. Behind me, I see chocolate, and a lot of it. Chocolate bunnies, yes, it's Palmer, but it's still chocolate, and your kids don't care what it tastes like. Only you do. And to be real, I'm gonna eat Palmer chocolate bunny anyway. <laughs> if that's my only option. You gonna have Harry Bows? Gosh, it's on brand. Happy Hoppers. That is sweet. Ooh, a double crispy bunnies. What is one thing that you would always get in your Easter baskets that you just classically remember? Like for me, we always got the big ears. Like the bunny with that was like a foot tall or maybe two feet tall. I don't remember. Those are Smarties and you get a pack of them. Um, but the bunny was so tall and we got one every year. We also always got these bubble gum shaped eggs. Those were fun. What else is classic over here? Oh, they have, what's inside? Gummies and games. That's fun. It's always more fun when they get a character that they know. Ooh, lemon heads. Who likes a lemon head? You know what? I like warheads. I don't know why I like warheads. Not even sure I do anymore, but I used to. <laughs> All right. Oh, they even have Mike and Ike's with some bunnies on them. Trolley gummies? Starburst? Ooh, M&M's. Here for that. Hold on. I passed these up. This is classic. Not just any old slime. It's Nickelodeon slime. Yeah. Remember that game like Double Dare or something? What was that called? That was like one of my favorites. They should bring that game back. I feel like Ellen's Game of Games is kind of like, what was it called? Double Dare? or double something. I don't know, Flarp is fun too. Oh my gosh, they even have a pack of Play-Doh. A four pack of Play-Doh. Now this is where the steel's at. It's not just a four pack, it's an eight pack. Double steel alert. Screaming Dean. I'm in the stationary aisle and these would be great as basket fillers or egg fillers as well, just stickers. Like cut them in half, roll them up, you know what I mean? Wait, do I see a hat down there? Beach hats? and flippy floppies. Don't worry, beach happy. Life is better in flip flops. No one's gonna be able to read that when you have them on. Oh my gosh, stop it right now. Flamingo flip flops, mermaid flip flops. Guys, these are one dollar. I always really enjoy the stationery section, but they have these as well. Um, if you like to do planners, it's a great price. They also have a really wide variety of candles as well. Do they smell great? I don't know, you decide. And then they have these little satchels. You can throw them in your drawer or your closet. I don't care if you like that stuck on you. Oh my gosh, look at the little cactuses inside of there. Oh, are these new or something? Keep being amazing. Mermaid vibe only? and then you are amazing. Okay, so those are pretty cool, not gonna lie. They also have these, oh my gosh, the donuts. Oh, there's one more, Pure Bliss. I'm gonna sniff on this. Yeah, not my favorite, not gonna lie. Even these are just pretty, you know what I mean? These little candle holders. Oh, there's one more back here. Good morning. Over here, just these candles are cute, especially for a dollar, you know what I mean? Oh, these are darling as well. And when the candle's gone, you can use this for whatever you want. These wall stickers are great as well. They always have a pretty large variety and they change them up a lot. They've got letters. I mean, you can do so many things with these, make a canvas out of them. Oh my gosh, that unicorn, hi. And then they always have an aisle or two dedicated. Do you see all these toys? So many toys. <laughs> and you can shove all of this in the Easter baskets. They even have coloring books and books. Oh my gosh, I ran into a box. Like, look at that. They have Frozen 2 coloring books. They have, oh my gosh, they even have books that come with markers. They have board books. 
And then my favorite, because it's such a deal, these crossword puzzles and Sudoku word finds. My kids are really into these. And then they even have a bunch of adult books as well. Just love this so much. Great big word finds. These are so fantastic and they're only a dollar. Oh my gosh, what is this? Toy Story 4. Guys, this, those characters in Toy Story 4 are so funny. A coloring and activity book. They just have so many options, it's fantastic. Look what I found behind me. Legit Barbie brand little career mini dolls. I feel like at Target this would be $9.99. At the DT it's only $1. Oh wait, they have Barbie clothes? And this is like Barbie brand clothes. I'm freaking out inside a little bit. Have they always sold these? Oh, so fashionable. Okay, now I'm browsing. Chicken soup for the soul, inspirational word finds. Do you guys remember reading any of these chicken soup books? Okay, now this stuff would be great for an Easter basket. A slap hand, yes please. Harmonica, always. Recorder, I mean, come on. Do you guys, what's the song, the first song you learned on the recorder? My Little Pony? No, that's just Pony. Wait, wait, wait. Oh my, hold on a second. Did I come to the Dollar Tree on the right day? Look at this stuff. Incredibles, and then they have Spongebob and Nickelodeon merchandise. Okay, I don't know a lot about Nickelodeon, but if you do, they have some care. Oh wait, wait, isn't that Arnold? Hey Arnold. All right, they even have My Little Pony, like legit, the same brand. What are these, Littlest Pet Shop, WWE guys, if you are into that. Oh wait, is that John Cena? Stop it, it is. Amazing, I should get that for my mom. <laughs> a light up spinner. Guys, this, these doors are just a dollar. They have Barbie? It's the last one. Guys, nothing Barbie brand is a dollar. This is amazing. They have the Incredibles, did I already show that? What is this? Oh, oh string a majiggy Seems interesting. I mean, totally cool for one dollar basket filler item. They've got some slime zombie heads. Also some more zombie stuff back there. I'm here for it. Wait, what is this? Monsters? Oh my, oh my gosh, stop it right now, Forky. What? And then they have some more monster stuff, but like, where's the rest of this stuff? I would like to know, please. I don't know what this is. A Zoops? Seems like, oh gosh, what do those Visco girls say? And I oop? That's what it sounds like, a zoo? I don't know what they are, but they seem pretty cool and wacky. I'm here for it, especially since it's only $1. That doesn't look like a dollar quality toy. You know what I mean? What is that? It says chalk, but it looks like powder. This is interesting. What do you do with this? Throw it at someone? I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like it because I'm going to be the one doing the laundry. You know what I mean? Oh, I see Toy Story 4. Little goodie bags, Toy Story 4 goodie bags. Or a surprise mini figure. Oh, this is so fun. I think I'm just obsessed with Toy Story 4 right now. That is amazing and it's only a dollar. These are randomly hidden away. Little planner, st oh my gosh, a flamingo. Planner stickers couple more right there 323 to be exact and 265 stickers in that one and I don't think I've mentioned these in a while but these would be great as a basket stuffer because they're functional um, they are like character little washcloth towels isn't that cool this is great just any to add to, add to any birthday gift or something you know Ooh, Ninja Turtles cool all right I found some more stuff oh I found the Toy Story stuff I found some Nemo. This is the what I initially saw and thought, oh, that's worth it, hold on. They even have, are you sinking kidding me? Is that Ryan Toy Reviews? My mind is blowing right now. This little nine-year-old is a bajillionaire. They've got Bo Peep back here. Guys, I feel like I hit the jackpot with my Dollar Tree today. Paw Patrol figurines, Ninja Turtles, more WWE guys. Oh my gosh, should I buy one of each? Earplugs, worth it. Eleanor right now has an ear infection because she got water in her ears. Yep, that's the truth, went swimming in a lake. That's what happens. I feel like I'm at a Beverly Hills Dollar Tree. Look at all of these t-shirts. They sell t-shirts here for a dollar. 
Okay, here it is. I found it. The Mecca of bath stuff. First of all, they sell a pack of four loofahs. Four loofahs? You could put some party packs together. They've got bath bombs, but here's the big one. For, ooh, shower fizzy. What is a shower fizzy? I like it. I like this, love it, want some more of it. But this is the main attraction, the Yes To You face masks. What's down here? Dollar Tree face masks. But the Yes To You ones, guys, a dollar for these is impeccable. Hold the phone because you get three in here for just, you guessed it, one dollar. And that's just amazing to me. And then they have that paper one up there. Guys, should I buy these? No. Am I going to? Probably. Can you guess what else they have here? Back scratchers. Alex just told me this morning he bought one. I bet you he spent way more than a dollar on it. I'm just saying. Oh wait, what on earth is this? A bath burst? That's a cactus, guys. These would be fun in, in a little basket. What am I talking about? An Easter basket? Okay. And hold on, don't sleep on this beauty aisle because they often have little things like this. Chapstick, a two pack of Trolls chapstick. Again, $1, even for the adults. I mean, this stuff, the Vaseline chapstick at Target, I compare my prices to Target because I don't shop anywhere else. Nordstrom, just kidding. Wait, rosy lips? I'm gonna give this one a try. I need some rosy lips. Oh wait, they have Mentos, <laughs> interesting. What's behind it, Coca-Cola? All right. Well, if you like Coca-Cola, no better place to buy your chapstick than the good old DT. They have cocoa butter right there, Blistex. Anyway, at Target, this would be, I don't know, $14.99. <laughs> okay, I'm on my way to the front aisle. I skipped over this earlier. Meredith's awake. I flipped her around and now she's, ooh, she can see the world. Hi, Meredith. She doesn't even care about you. She cares about the products at the Dollar Tree. Okay, anyway, a bucket of cotton candy. Who wouldn't want that? They have speckled jelly beans, normal jelly beans. Ooh, Starburst jelly beans. Sour Patch, my kids really like Sour Patch. I don't know who bought it for them. Oh, I can never resist these. I'm gonna have to think of my thighs. Peanut butter dove eggs. Oh, thank God the box is empty, because I'm telling you, I don't know if I would have the willpower to resist that. They also have a lot of stuffed animals. And here they are, the dreaded peeps. This is a debate. Do you love them? Do you hate them? I would rather eat Reese's eggs. Just saying. <laughs> oh, wait, a ton more up here. Oh, fantastic. I saw the jumbo ones at Target the other day. Wanted to vomit. Remember the other day at Target when I bought a little pack of tissues? I was gonna say napkins for a dollar. You can get a four pack with characters for a dollar here. A four pack with characters, without care. These are so much more fun. Oh my gosh, those cats are in space. How can you resist that? And again, Toy Story 4. And oh my gosh, a three pack of chap ice. I'm in line. I left my cart. Ooh, all the goodies I got. I did get the face masks. The little haul right there for you. Okay. They always throw a bunch of awesome stuff right at the checkout. These, as if the whole store isn't a big impulse buy. They have tattoos. Um, and then back here I saw zombie tattoos. That is pretty fun. Dinosaurs. Mer I just think, you know tribal tattoos oh my gosh furry friend tattoo guys amazing there they are warheads just what i want in my life but then down here the rainbow i'm gonna grab one of these this is fantastic for eleanor is gonna die when she sees this they also have this cute little room decor oh my gosh it says girl boss oh i love this so much flamingo tape dispenser and then down here i bought one of these last year the scent is like not that great but if you're a kid you probably love it and then this little narwhal how can you say no to that narwhal narwhal causing a commotion that's a pretty sweet pouch reminds me of the 90s dream big that was it that was everything at the dt <laughs> i did buy some stuff because you know what i had the ball in my cart and i thought oh since i'm buying the ball i might as well get 
the books, the word books for the girls. And then I thought, well, since I'm getting stuff, I might as well get more. <laughs> it's a snowball effect. Okay, I'm gonna throw this in my car and then go to Home Goods. That might be a shop with me. I don't know. I have to be home in 30 minutes. So, okay, that is that. Thank you so much for watching and hanging out and shopping with me. I hope you enjoyed your time at the Dollar Tree. Uh, if you did, subscribe, put a little happy in your day, and I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> Did I get it? <laughs> Did I get it?